And now, ladies and gentlemen, Larry Kudlow is with us, National Economic Council Director. Mr. Kudlow, welcome back to the program. Good to see you, sir. Thank you, Stuart. Appreciate it. Um, this is um, round two of our jobs market discussion. I think that 155 new jobs last month is disappointing. I would have thought it would have been much higher, bearing in mind the tax cut earlier this year. And you say what, sir? Well, that's a good number. I mean, we had 250,000 last month, which beat everybody's expectations. And we're running, let's see, 206,000 new jobs per month. Uh, through November in 2018. That's a very big number historically. Uh, wages are rising 3.1 percent. The unemployment rate is 3.7. Unemployment Larry, rate almost look. fell. Almost, we almost got the unemployment rate to a rounding of 3.6, but not quite. So, yes, but, still, I think but, it's a good number. But, okay, but look, you've got 4 percent growth in the second quarter, 3.5 percent growth in the third quarter, and in the fourth quarter, we're looking at maybe 2.5 percent growth and only 155,000 new jobs in November. That's a nasty downtrend, and it's not what we were expecting, bearing in mind all that you had said about the tax cuts and what they do for the overall economy. Well, Stu, I'm going to take the over on your 2.5% uh, forecast. So we'll, have to, we'll settle up the bet later on. But I would also say this. The economy is now in a 3%-plus trajectory. Uh, since President Trump came in, the seven quarters, not the first quarter in 2017, he has no power over there, but the seven quarters, uh, we're running, I believe, the number is 3.1%. And it's 3.3 percent so far for 20, 2018. That's right. Look, nobody said we could beat two. Obama's was, you know, one to two percent. Uh, we're running now three plus. So that's a pretty big thing. And I might add, we're seeing capital goods uh, were revised higher in the uh, latest GDP report. I, I think that's solid. Uh, I, I want very much to spend my time. Uh, making you happy and satisfying your <laughs> deepest desires. Well, his, I'm working on that. Here's how you can do I it. Can. Tell me that we're going to get 3% growth next year. We're going to get 3% growth next year. <laughs> you no, can, no. We're going to get 3%. I mean, I'm saying it again. Um, I spend a good part of my day making sure that you are happy and satisfied. But I actually believe we will get 3% growth next year. And I believe the supply side policies. Look, what's happening here is. The potential to grow is, is greater. Output is increasing at better than 3 percent. The inflation rate, with more goods being produced and more efficiently with productivity at 2 now, the inflation rate is actually disinflating down to about 1.5 percent. It doesn't get much better than that. And that's why you see all these Fed people uh, now saying publicly that um, we're at neutral and they're not going to have to do uh, perhaps anything after the next meeting and uh, later this month. And maybe they won't do anything at, th at that meeting. So it's a pretty darn good combination. 